11,000 lightning strikes in three days. Historic storms are behind hundreds of wildfires tearing through California right now. Good afternoon, I'm Kimberly Hunt. In Northern California, the LNU Lightning Complex fires exploded to nearly 50,000 acres in Napa, Sonoma, and Solano counties. At least 100 structures have burned. The La Honda fire, also sparked by lightning, is 0% contained in San Mateo, as well as Santa Cruz counties, growing to more than 10,000 acres. 367 fires are burning across California. Right now, every county in the Bay Area is on fire, except for San Francisco. And the governor says our resources are getting stretched thin. ABC 10 News reporter Jennifer De La Cruz explains the new partnership with other states aimed at getting these fires under control. California on fire, battling natural disasters amid an energy crisis and a global pandemic. Governor Gavin Newsom announcing Wednesday the request for out-of-state resources to help fight the battle. Engines and crews from Arizona, Nevada, and Texas on track to assist with the 367 fires currently burning in the state. In addition to a prolonged heat wave with record-breaking temperatures, the governor attributes the cause in part to more than 10,000 lightning strikes in the past few days. Putting everything we have uh, on these fires, they're stretched all across the state of California, uh, and we're now getting the support uh, of some of our partners in the western United States. And for that, again, we are very grateful. On Tuesday, Newsom declared a statewide emergency, securing federal resources to get these fires under control. This year, the California legislature approved more than $72 million to bring on hundreds of seasonal firefighters for this very reason. 830 of those 858 have already been uh, brought on. This just over the course of the last few weeks. The heat also putting a strain on California's power supply. Newsom hoping the peak of that strain is almost over. Tonight, uh, we believe uh, in the immediate is the last uh, night. We really need everybody to do everything in their power uh, to flex their power use, power consumption. Jennifer Dela Cruz, ABC 10 News.